Well, now to a story that proves a simple cup of coffee can do a lot more than just wake you up. Yeah, how about this? In this week's Heart of Detroit, Mitch Album introduces us to Dan Dewey, but folks know him a whole lot more as Dan the Coffee Man. <laughs> I love coffee, I love tea. While keeping his father company during chemo treatments, Dan Dewey discovered the powerful effect of a simple cup of coffee. He gets in the big blue chair, is what I call it, and I says, do you want anything? And he goes, no, I'm fine. And I knew there was a Starbucks a mile away, and I loved the moment. I stood up and I looked both directions, and there's all these people sitting in the blue chairs hooked up to chemo. I says, I'm going for coffee. Who wants something? And that's exactly how it started. Dan now stops by either St. Joe's MCI Clinic or the Rose Center of Beaumont every week to bring chemo patients a cup of coffee and a little conversation. The word spread real quick that I come on Thursday, and so it was always full. And the people on Wednesday would get upset. So then five <laughs> years ago, I started going on Wednesday. <laughs> He quickly became known as Dan the Coffee Man. Wouldn't have it any other way. Well, it's more than just putting a cup of coffee in front of them. I show up in shorts with a sweatshirt and a, and a scarf on, and they look at me. Now I got them, because I know what they're thinking. Mm -hmm. Please don't let him be the doctor. <laughs> I, know, I know that's... Dan has delivered coffee to area clinics over 500 times, averaging around 90 to 100 cups of coffee per week, all free of charge, an act of kindness that has become his passion. And I've had like literally 65 full-time jobs in my life. How does being the coffee man stack up against the, the other 60 plus jobs? This is the best one yet. Just to see somebody smile that didn't plan on it. 10 years of giving with no end in sight, Dan Dewey is bringing caffeinated happiness Cheers. to the heart of Detroit. And for free, how about that? And he, that is, well, free for some, but not for some, not, not for, for people issue. getting it. Right. But that was, um, uh, I guess we'll call it premium coffee that he was uh, carting around there. So what a great <laughs> so gesture. So nice. <laughs> but it's they fantastic. don't want to, Freddie's the doctor. <laughs>